We just finished watching President Trump announce his campaign for re-election. And in some ways it seemed, like, very familiar. Wow. Whoa. That is some group of people. Thousands. What a turnout. What a turnout. A lot has changed since 2015. Breathtaking changes throughout the federal government. ISIS gained and lost territory. Russia interfered in the 2016 presidential election. Prince was still alive. R.I.P. But that's besides the point. It's four years later. How does what he said then stack up with what he said tonight? And what's happened in the last four years? Ladies and gentlemen, I am officially running for President of the United States. Thank you. Let's take a look at memorable claims from 2015 that came back tonight. Last quarter, it was just announced, our gross domestic product, a sign of strength, right? But not for us. It was below zero. Who ever heard of this? Our economy is the envy of the world perhaps the greatest economy we've had in the history of our country. The GDP wasn't zero in 2015, and the economy isn't the best ever now. The president can certainly brag about the state of the economy, but he runs into trouble when he makes a play for the history books. I will build a great, great wall on our southern border, and I will have Mexico pay for that wall. Yeah. Mark my words. Yeah. And we are building the wall. We're going to have over 400 miles of wall built by the end of next year. It's moving rapidly. Trump's wall is not being built. There's fencing being built, and fences are not walls. Reduce our 18 trillion in debt, because believe me, we're in a bubble. In 2015, President Trump made a big deal about lowering the national debt. It's gone up substantially since he took office. We have a stock market that is so bloated. Be careful of a bubble, because what you've seen in the past might be small potatoes compared to what happens. Today, we had a massive day on the stock market. A lot of good things are happening, but we had a very big day, and we're very close to, I think, our 68th record. President Trump said it was a bubble in 2015, but now he claims credit for the stock market gains. Really, it's going in the same direction. President Trump likes to imagine that everything changed when he took office. It didn't. Most trends continued in the same direction that they had during the Obama administration. And he hasn't accomplished many of the things that he claimed.